If Russia ever joined forces with China, American global hegemony, its power would end instantly. You'd have the world's largest landmass and largest natural gas reserves allied with the world's largest population and world's largest economy. So a Russia-China axis would be not just more powerful than the United States, but much more powerful. It would have the scale to control a lot of the world's economy and trade routes and raw materials. It could project military force that, posturing aside, we actually don't have the power to stop. If Russia and China ever got together, it would be a brand new world and the United States would be greatly diminished. Most Americans agree that would be bad. Thanks to Joe Biden's reckless and self-destructive response to the invasion of Ukraine a year ago this week, the economies of Russia and China are intertwined. Chinese spending on Russian goods has increased by more than 60%. China now imports more coal from Russia than it has in the last five years. Chinese shipments to Russia, meanwhile, are up by nearly 30%. Not surprisingly, the Chinese UN is replacing the dollar in Moscow. Chinese currency now accounts for fully one-fifth of all trades on the Moscow Stock Exchange. That's up from less than 1% last year. So these are deep and growing economic ties, and they're formal. The thing about economic ties, however, is that they lead inexorably to military ties. So it shouldn't surprise you that China is actively helping Russia in the war against NATO, which we are leading. In other words, the country with more ships than any navy in the world has united with the country that has more nuclear-armed ICBMs than any country in the world to fight us through proxy in Ukraine. Well, that's scary. And the thing is, everybody involved seems to know it's scary and just how scary it is. Our leaders understand that their push for total war with Putin, which is unnecessary, could lead to the destruction of the West. They know that, but they're doing it anyway. In an interview with a German newspaper today, the Ukrainian President Zelensky casually mentioned that, oh, by the way, the entire world may soon go up in flames. Quote, if China aligns itself with Russia, there will be a world war. There will be a world war if China aligns with Russia? Who could say something like that calmly? Since, as we just told you, China is aligned with Russia. It's already happened. That's not speculation. It's a fact. And as a result of that fact, according to Zelensky himself, hundreds of millions of people will die. No big deal, as long as we take Crimea. This is a very dark way of thinking. Zelensky himself is a very dark force. That is obvious if you watch him. It is unmistakable. Who could not see that? This man is a destroyer. He banned a Christian faith in his country and arrested nuns and priests. Oh, but he's a hero, claim our leaders, from Chuck Schumer to Mitch McConnell. No, Zelensky is not a hero. He is an instrument of total destruction. Why would we fight Russia, he wondered, wouldn't making Russia our enemy just drive Putin into the arms of China and create the most powerful and dangerous anti-American bloc in history? No one bothered to answer him. In fact, for the sin of asking, they called him a traitor to his country. They impeached him for it. And then they started a war with Putin. But in retrospect, Trump had asked a deeply patriotic question. If Russia ever joined forces with China, American global hegemony, its power would end instantly. You'd have the world's largest landmass and largest natural gas reserves allied with the world's largest population and world's largest economy. So a Russia-China axis would be not just more powerful than the United States, but much more powerful. Please like, subscribe and hit the notification button.